All right, how's it going, everyone? We're here at Petco Park. Phillies taking on the Padres here in game two. Ranger Suarez on the bump. And we got to remind the Padres fans what's up. Go, Phils. Now we're in. Entry sucks. Yes, it did. <laughs> $50 for parking. People don't move. All right. We'll ignore it. Let's get to batting practice if they're even having it. I don't know. There's Rob Thompson, the manager of the Phillies. He's managed his 300th game as the third best winning percentage through 300 games of any Phillies manager ever. So, attaboy Philly Rob. Yo, they're playing Paramore at Petco Park. Ain't it fun? Love it, love it. Good job, Padres, on that. All right, so this is Gallagher Square, kind of behind the, the field. They renovated this from the last time we were here. This looks a lot different. They got a whole band up here check this out they got a whole little wiffle ball feel with a scoreboard they even got the little jack-in-the-box head up there scoreboard that's very cool as that kid hits one fair that kid fielded it that's pretty cool they got a whole slide and a whole playground so this is kind of cool this is things they found when they were making the ballpark that's very cool oh sweet we get to check it out a little bit more all right, we're in the Padres Hall of Fame. Tony Gwynn, Trevor Hoffman, Randy Jones, Nate Colbert, Dave Winfield, Ray Kroc, Dick Williams, Benito Santiago. He was a Philly, I think, at one point. Gary Templeton, Ted Williams. That's an interesting one. Hometown sensation. Oh, and he played for the Padres in the old Gulf Coast. Okay. Jerry Coleman, Buzzy Bavasi, Kevin Towers. Oh, also, apologies if I butchered any of these names. Jack McKeon. Mc I don't know. Ken Kaminti. Cool. And then here's some history of the Padres. Babe Ruth up there. Finally, a mention of the chicken in this stadium. I've been looking all over, and now they mention the chicken. This is the rehatching after the lawsuit. Very, very famous. Oh, and here's some cool... Some cool baseballs. Finally, Tony Gwynn, Gold Glove, some All-Star Games, and a West Champions, Gary Sheffield. Steve Garvey's home run bat. There you go, Mom. Steve Garvey. Got too many, too many wives. Too, too many wives. Too many wives. <laughs> All right, a Tony Gwynn jersey. Very, very cool. Silver Slugger from, looks like Greg Vaughn. 1998 World Series, which they lost to the Yankees, I believe. Qualcomm being destroyed. Uh, yeah. Some of the Tony Gwynn stuff, that's very cool. Trevor Hoffman over here. Very cool. Joe Musgrove, no hitter. Uh, yeah, that's the Padres Hall of Fame. All right, here are the seats for the game today. Biolic bone stretching. Just about to get underway. Good view. We're almost ready for baseball. Here's the few toys today. Ho, Dads. We also got a cool souvenir cup as they're introing. Rangers actually walking out right now. Focus. Not focusing. There's Ranger. So, 
Yeah, and we got a cool souvenir cup. I'll show you the souvenir cup. That's not a great view of it, but uh, yeah, food review coming soon. Boo! Padres take the field. Boo, Padres, boo. Especially boo, ringworm man. All right, Kyle Schwarber is digging in to lead off the game, and people are going to block my view all night. The first pitch is blocked by that guy. Thanks a lot, that guy. We're underway in San Diego. All right, here's Bryce Harper. Trey Turner got a hit. Let's see if he continues his dad strength in this event. Two home runs in the last two games since coming back. The pitch. Swing and a miss. He was late on that one. Lifts at the center. Tatis shielding his son from the eye or eyes from the sun. Mix that up. And out. Shoot. And Alec Bohm is coming up. And this one's blasted way back to left field. And that is gone. And man, Alec Bohm is ready. He jumps on the first pitch from Dylan Cease. It's his fourth homer of the season. Alec Bohm sends one out against Dylan Cease. And the Phillies have a one nothing or two nothing lead here early. At a boy Bomer. First pitch. He was all over it. Let's go, Alec. No replays here. No replays here for opposing team stuff. Boo Padres on that front. Rangers Suarez on the mound, making his last warm-up pitch. Head to the bottom of the first. Xander Bogart's leading things off for the Padres. Filled up 2-0. A little longer than a few minutes later. Base is loaded for the Phillies here in the fifth, and Cease walks in with Merrifield and brings up the hottest hitter on the Phillies right now, Alec Bohm, three nothing fills here in the fifth. Alec Bohm coming. He might up. be the hottest hitter on a planet. He could be that. I mean, there might be some kid in the little league. It's like 12 for his last 12, but line drive, base hit to right field. Schwarber scores. Here comes Turner. The throw to the plate is not in time. A two-run single for Alec Bohm, and the Phillies' lead is up to five. That kid's celebrating. Five nothing Bills. Alec Bohm has three RBIs tonight. Let's check out the replay up here. Smooth base hit over the first baseman's head. And now JT has a chance to add on a few more. Trey was not hustling. I don't know what he was doing on that play at all, but he still scored. So five nothing Bills. All right, Bills got three in that inning. They lead five nothing here in the bottom of the fifth. After this inning, we're gonna go for a walk. Ranger Suarez is the coolest dude to ever exist. And he is now through five. Swag toss time. And time to walk. Are there any swag tossers in our section? No. Swinging prior. There he is. Go, guy, go. He's so cool. I like him. All right, we're walking along the second deck here in San Diego. Very thin. I'm kind of afraid of heights, so I walk closer to the wall. But they got a bridge to the Coronado Club up here. They got some stuff. Gordon Brew? Specialty sandwiches? Okay. Padres? I kind of want to do see what they have in there. All right, over here we got Pizza Port. They got hot dogs, nachos, pretzels. Oh, they got everything over there. Like, dude, this stadium kind of has literally everything. It's very nice. I'm gonna let these people pass us. Lemonade. I like the old timey photos back here. Like, just very cool. Kyle Schwarber once hit a baseball over like there. And it does, that, that's, yeah, he hit it far. Kyle Schwarber, baseball, hit it far. All right, we're in the Lexus Club. I found a ticket on the ground that lets us into the Lexus Club. That just lets us in here. And we're gonna move down and watch the game from here because this is awesome. Maybe we can find a table or something in the Lexus Club and just have a seat and watch the game. But yeah, we are close to the field.
Okay, it is currently the top of the eighth. We are just sitting at one of these little tables. We found this ticket. We tried to get down there. The guy told us no. But we do get into the Lexus Club, which is this little area back here, a little bar. And we get to sit here for the rest of the game. So... I wasn't supposed to find that. Do I feel bad about taking advantage for it? No, not really. But, uh, yeah. Go Phils. Ranger Suarez is out for his eighth inning of work right now. The pitch to Kim inside. Here is your score. Rangers at 87 pitches. It's probably his last inning with a pretty short lead. Oh, God damn it. Home run Rosario with two outs in the bottom of the eighth. 5-1. The fire was kind of cool. The homer was not. All right, one more out, Ranger. One more, and then we can bring in the bullpen. All right, then a ground out follows it up. Ranger Suarez with eight innings of work today. That's probably it for him. But an absolutely great day, and he's going to get a standing ovation from the field faithful here in San Diego. Look at this, Castellanos congratulating him on a great day. Look at that, oh man. Look at how big he's smiling. Look at the Phillies fans lying in the dugout. Ranger walks off the field, oh man. How about that? All right, Trey Turner is up in the ninth. Bryce Harper's on deck. I'm just getting video because we're really close and I'm usually not this close. Uh, so enjoy this. This pitch is inside, almost hit Turner. Jeff Hoffman in for the fills in the ninth. And it's gonna be this guy for the Padres. Wade. Three more out. Padres down to their final out. Five to one fills. Bottom of the ninth, two away. The first pitch to Tatis. In there for a strike, strike one. Fills looking to take the series with a chance for a sweep tomorrow. And the pitch to Tatis. Swing and a miss, strike two. 0 oh 2. Fans on their feet. The 0 2 pitch to Tatis. Swing and a miss, the Phillies win it. How about that? Phillies take the first two from the Padres. A big day for Alec Bohm, three RBIs, and the Phillies win. Final score, five to one, Ranger fantastic. He went eight innings in this one. Incredible, incredible. So this is the Lexus Club. Uh, we got the free ticket into here. I found it on the ground, and it's pretty cool. Uh, next game, we got some cool picture stuff. Like, it's basically a bar, but really fancy upscale. Very, very cool. And what's all this? That just looks like it's crowded. So we're gonna go the other way. All right, mom. I usually do this with dad. The Petco Park Review. Dad is back at home in Arizona. This is just a me and you trip for graduation. What did you think of Petco Park? Two enthusiastic thumbs up. Two enthusiastic thumbs up. Phil's win 5-1.
Uh, tell everyone about the magic ticket we found. We found a magic ticket to the dugout and the Lexus car. But the, dug the guy at the dugout was like, I know the people who have these tickets. You can't come here. And we were like, uh oh. But, we hung in but that's not good. But we hung in the club and the club was nice. We watched the rest of the game. And now we have to find our parking. But yeah, uh, thank you for watching this video. Go Phils. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Back here at Pego Park for game three, Taiwan Walker on the Mount. Oh God.